good morning see those who are pursuing uh, for uh, selection of judicial magistrate examination likely to be held shortly and applications are invited already must understand uh, uh, particularly the procedures of trials so what is summon case summary trial warrant case warrant case instead upon police complaint warrant case instead upon private complaint and sessions trial instead upon sessions case uh, police complaint and uh, sessions trial instead upon private complaint how to club together how to record evidence this is a vital aspect apart from this chapter should be understood and another was that the framing of charge which plays vital role if you understand these areas absolutely then you will get definitely get through the examination apart from that the question of joinality the remand procedures 167 remand procedures all uh, is vital part of uh, trial because if anybody is being produced for remand under 167 if is happens to be joinal then what to do what not to do even the supreme court time and again has stated that if any person is produced below the 21 years then there should be some medical examinations see joinal justice act has been time to time amended and the latest act is 2016 uh that uh, act uh, now been termed uh, the nomenclature of joinal justice care and protection of children act section 92 and 94 uh, plays vital and uh, uh, when an application was filed under article 32 for the same relief and that was dismissed here a pension under section 9 class 2 to fix the age before the joinal justice home or before the court in before which before which the accused is produced or likely to be tried the most important aspect see they say the section 92 empowered to make inquiry that it should be what was the age at the time of commission of the offence the there is no procedures uh, uh, prescribed to hold an inquiry under 9 class 2c joinal justice act but the supreme court has said there need not be any examination or cross examination of the witnesses summary inquiry is sufficient that was the held then the problem was uh, which uh, how the date of birth certificate to be relied how it should not be relied all these things are there so far uh, the the present judgment is concerned they however held the child was uh, between age 12 to 12 years and 6 month only at the time of alleged commission of offense the ossification test is the another ch- uh, choice if the age of the journal could not be substantiated or proved with primary evidence of birth certificate or school certificates ossification test means uh, by observing the physical uh, physical growth of the uh, teeth sternum and other joints uh, pubic uh, pubic bones uh, everything will be calculated and also pubic hair pubic hair will also be considered to fix the age this is most important therefore unless and until you are at home with joinal justice home mind that it is very difficult to get over the examination unless and until you are more powerful and having high nepotism uh, recommendation this is what i want to express and share with you so kindly uh, this is what they say section 92 is an application uh, 94 is the procedures uh, the supreme court has uh, and uh, elaborately discuss go through the entire of the judgment you are really interested to get to the examination uh, 
the judgment Birad Mal Singhvi versus Anand Prohit. In if there is no record of proof, including Parivar card being maintained at the village administrative officers or authorities, then only ossification test. So kindly go through. And Section 35 also, uh, the Indian Evidence Act deals with how the documents are uh, being maintained. I hope you understand uh, my endeavor uh, today. Thank you.